Hey guys, what's up? It's Renee. So today I wanted to test this matte top coat. Yeah, I saw it in Target. It was 10 49 and i like the aesthetics of the brand it comes in the box which i think is really nice and then the seven free things that like the things that this doesn't have this is a vegan and cruelty free brand i'm all for cruelty free it has a bunch of like details all around that makes a nicer experience in my opinion so i'm just going to be opening this and so this is what the bottle looks like i like it and i think it's aesthetic pleasing because it looks clean and it has like this uh, gold elephant which i think is really cute and I'm not really sure, but I think they say that elephants are good luck. Okay, so firstly, my nails are different from the last clip that you saw. I was wearing fake nails, way too big for me. And now I switched to deep powder, so that's what I'm using. But now I'm going to be using these two polishes. And this one's I'm using this black one. And then this one I'm using this Ella Plasmilla Desire, and this is the name of it. I made a review on this, well, two of them that I bought. For this review, I wanted to have longer nails because I feel like especially the beige ones, in my opinion, they look amazing when the beige is matte. But I broke one and I just had to cut them all and I had to start all over again. I like the battle of it. It's big and you can just cover a lot of nail with it. It doesn't have like a weird smell. It's just the usual. Feels smooth and it's real hard to do because the camera is just right on top but as long as you can see it's okay now for this one and i hope it dries fast it's real hard with this one because you are the camera is like right on top and it's really hard to i just i like i can't base myself from what i see on the screen if that makes sense so if i'm making a really bad job that's why i can't really see and this is the last one i like the brush i love it actually i wish all brushes were like that where it's like fluffy enough but not like too big and the beige ones are looking really nice i like it it's like kind of between satin and matte as for the black ones though you can kind of see the bad job that i did with the deep powder in my nail polish application Missing some spots, especially here, kind of like shows more like the mistakes or the flaws that you have, I guess. But I'm, yeah, I'm gonna be wearing this all throughout a couple of days. Okay, guys, so this is what my nails look like. I applied my matte top coat on Monday and it's not Wednesday. It only has like this tiny spot, like white spot, only on that nail. I have no idea what that is. But as you can see, they're pretty much going back to shiny again when i read the instructions it says that it's a satin matte top coat so it's not matte top coat but you only know that when you read the instructions right so it doesn't say anything in the bags on the outside i wish the bags would have said satin matte top coat i thought it was like a matte top coat but it's not but yeah it's not like matte matte it's satin it says right in the back but it's just not in the front so i just want to show you guys and compare so this is the nail freshly painted then this is what it looks like when you just apply top coat and then this is it after two days so it's not as shiny as the first day but it's not matte same goes for this freshly painted matte top coat two days and then we have this little guest right here somebody left me a comment a while ago on another matte top coat i reviewed saying that you're supposed to apply one coat of regular top coat and then a coat of like the matte one so it lasts longer i have no idea but maybe if it works it's worth it but anyways guys i'll let you be the judge of this one as a satin this is what you get if it helped and if you liked it don't forget to give this a thumbs up check out more nail care that i have on my channel subscribe for more let me know what you think of this one and share this if you know of any matte matte top coat that lasts let me know thank you so much for watching i'll talk to you later and take care bye guys